እናቷ ልጅም እናቲቱም በዚህ አይነት አስቀምጣው ኒየ በስጥቶኝ ተሰው ጋር ማልቀመጥ ሰው ሲጠላኝ ግዚያ ሰው ሲጠላኝ ግዚያ ዝም ብዬ እዚህ ላይ ለሞት ብዬ ሸፈኛ ነው ተቀመጥኩኝ ጌታ ይለ በጥግ በነሱ ጥጋቸው በታዛው ነው ዝም ብዬ ተቀመጠ በዙሪያ ነው እንዲያ ስለሆነ ትብይ ነው እንጂ ተኔ ተማጠኔ ወጣች አይደለች ተኔ ምን እሻ ላይ ያታለች ነጥ እንዲያንድ ሳምንት ቆየብኝ በሆዴ ቀረ ትግሩ እንደደረሰብኝ ያነን ጎትቶ አውስቶ ለሊት እኩል ተኝቼሳለ ኑሮ ማተባል ቤት ነበር ሁን በዚህ የተነሳ ሄጅልኝ አይሆንም እንዴት ሆን ሽ ሌላ ላግባ ብሎ ሌላ ግባ መጫቴቱን ያውም የስድስት ስቶሪ ቱን ይዥ ወስጨ እዚህ ምስጨ ተቀመጠ ሁን እዚህ በጥግ ነው እንዴት ሆነ ተቀመጠ ናውሮ ማስኖር ነገር ስለሆነ ቢ እንዴት ዋላችሁ ሁሉ ምን ሰው ስለማስገባበት ዝም ብዬ እንዴ ይሁን ሆነ ተቀምጨ ሌላም ተዳራለኝ ስራ አልሰራ እናላረክ ፈሳዝ እንዳልቀረ እዚ ላይ ነው ተሸሽጌ ተቀምጨ ዞን ቢሩ ቦዲ ውስጥ ግርም ሆኖ ሞታል አቂሞ እየገባ እየወጫጨቀ እየወጫጨቀ ወጣ እየወጨቀ በቃ ያለ ለሞታው አዋጣው ዋላ ባፈር ደስጊ ወርስ ተኛ ጀምራ ጓዛው ይወሰስ ተዚዋሪያ ታመን ሆኝ 10 አመት ልሚያ እንደም ለናን ደናንሽ 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 ዛፍ ጥላው ነው መስንፈው ዛፍ ነው ይቅዳለኝ አዎ እንዴ ዳንተ ሰው እንጠጋ እንደዚህ ተሰው ያምን ነው በመኪና ውስጥ እንኳን ራሱ እንደዚህ ሁኘ እንዴ አርጓ ፍንጫቸውን ይዘው ሲሉ ወይድ ልክ ቅስሜ ንክት እንደዚህ እንደዚህ እንደፈ ስለ ኖርቢቱ ዛሬ እንደውም ማናት እንግራ ስማሃው እንዴ አረጉና ተሰፋሁን ኖርማን ሰው ተጓደኞች ተታከጀ ጫቄ አዲስ ለብሽ እንደዚህ ተጓደኞች ተታከረ ሀደሽን ተቀደሽ አዎ ምንም አይሰማሽም ነው ላይ ተቀደደ አይሰማሽም ምን ይቀደደው እነሱ አሉ ያ ነፍስሽ እንዲያ ተቀደደ መመለሻ ነው መመለሻ አላቸው አሁን ፋስቱ ለለመርት ቻ ያለሽ አቺም ቤት ያዲስ አበባ ላይ ሽንግሪ ነው ማተብሽ ከተች ደስ ተኩሴ ሲናል 
These women are not welcome in a general hospital. They can't often get in because of the um, tremendous pressure on the hospitals for other more urgent things. Also, they're not welcome because they're smelling and they're poor and they're often turned away by the guard at the gate. And this is really why we built the hospital. Nene.
Some help is needed when the baby can't be born in the usual 12 hours that it takes to have a baby. Usually it's due to a small pelvis or a malposition of the baby inside the mother's uterus. It occurs all over the world. In 5% of all neighbours, help is needed. Ayo. Ayo, Mano. Smara. Smara. I'm emotional. Sash. Sagara, I'm a teacher. 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 She starts labour and she expects to be perhaps delivered by the evening, if it's the morning, early morning. But the day goes by and she hasn't had the baby. The village women encourage her. The second day goes by, and even the third and fourth, up to ten days, I've had a woman in labour. By that time, the little girl is exhausted, dehydrated, and she finally pushes out a dead baby. But she wakes up to a worse horror. Hey, so the size of the fistula is two by three centimeter. Every time the uterus contracts, it pushes that baby's head against the bone of the pelvis. The blood supply of that area is cut off. So that lump of tissue that's being squashed will die and it just drops out. So this means that she's lost some of her bladder or some of her rectal wall. The fistula patient is not only physical trauma they are suffering of, it's the social and then psychological. You know, in the countryside, it's being a woman is be able to be a wife, be a child to, you know, and have a family. But when they fail to do that, they consider themselves that they are not like any woman. He said, you go back to your family. He'll just send her off with a bundle on her back. They run out to welcome her, thinking that she's coming home with a baby. And they find her in this state. Her life is ruined. So they'll build her a little hut outside. And there she will stay till death, unless she hears that she can be cured.
እንጨቱ እንደርድር ዝም ጊዜ ላይ ይሳቆየ ምት ምኝታ ነው ተቀምጨ ነው ማለት ምኝታ ነው እንደዚህ ያለ ሰው ኑራል ብያል አስቡ አሶስ ዝቦ አልቋል አልቆሳልን የብቻ ነኝ መስሎኛ Most peasant women in the developing world have to do all the hard work They have to do the cooking the grinding of the corn the collecting of the water from the well carrying sticks from the forest So all her energy has gone into work instead of into growth. She hasn't had enough nourishment. If we take someone like this little girl, What has happened is at the age of 2 she started carrying a jar of water. By the age of 8 she's carrying something that I can't lift. But all those years she's been eating a good diet but not enough calories. What happens is she grows short. Now if I stand you'll just see how short she is. And I'm an average height. I'm 5 foot 3. A girl, especially a girl in the countryside, they are too small for their age. So if she gets pregnant at the age of 14, definitely the baby will be too big for her pelvis to pass through during delivery. So she will end up in obstructed labor. አይክም ጌዛ መስቀኑ አይክም በትጂ ተገለገለ አ አጣፍተን ይወጣሩ ነው ምን 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 አላጊውት መላሰኪኝ ተዚያ ወደ ቤት አልጋ የበሽተኛው በዛ አልጋ አልቀቀያሉና ተነስጨ ያን እንልስ የነ ቀየርኩኝና ስነሳ ፈሰሰ ወራገር ይሄርኩኝ እዚያው ፈሰሰ አልሻለኛ ነ ተገላግሎ ስድስት ወር ወደዚያ ነው መጣ ተብየት የስተመከነ ስስተ ስድስት ሰነ ስብሪት ታጣቃሉ በዚያ ላይ ጨርቅ ወዞ ጉዛሉ መኪናው ላይ እንደፈስጊ የዚያ ላይም ደሞ ጣው ግመት ሲነካው ይከረፈል ሁሉ አፈንጨውን ያፍናል ዝም ብያን ገት እንደፊች ታነጭ መጣለኝ የዚ ደስ ይላል ለጠና ሁሉ ልሱ ነው ምኝታው ፈርናሽ They usually think they are the only person in the world who licks urine. So being at Fischler Hospital is a part of psychotherapy. They discuss their problem with other women. They start to understand that uh, there are other women with the same kind of problem. So this is very important to nurse them together and they have a social life together. We see them talking and they feel at home. They feel they're not being ostracized from their society and they're loved and they feel welcome. So this is where the healing process starts of the mind and this is very important. ግማሽ ድግም 
አለቺኝ አለቺኝ እሷ እና በደም ባርጋ ነው አትፍሪ አይዙሽ እንደኔ ዳኝ አሁን አኔ ደኛ አንቻ አትቀሪ ነው ደኔ ጠጋበኝ ዙሪ We've got this girl with her whole life ahead. And if she's not cured, it's going to be a misery and a horror to her forever. The fistula is not very big, well mobilized now, and uh, I'm going to close it. And this is the fascination of fistula surgery, to make a new life for a young girl that suffered more than any woman should be called on to endure. Right, just finished closing the fistula now and then we are going to do a diet test to make sure that the uh, uh, suture line is watertight. So we put a dye, if there is any hole, the dye comes through the, the hole. Now it's, uh, there is nothing coming through the hole. This means that the hole is closed completely. We leave her with a catheter draining for 12 or 14 days and we hope that she's going to be able to pass urine normally. The diatis is negative stress incontinence in the dynamics. Fistula? Ah, it's a little bit stress. The dynamic opitivus of Carilla, so I'm not still in the July edition. The uh, uh, fistula, that is the hole on the bladder, is closed. And uh, 
now uh, the bladder function is not restored. Mm -hmm. So we are going to uh, do certain examination, run certain tests, and see where, is, where the problem actually is. That's what we are measuring. This is a urodynamic examination. This is a machine uh, which measures the uh, intra-abdominal pressure, and it also measures at the same time the pressure inside the bladder. And then the machine will give us the bladder capacity, how much the bladder can hold. According to the, the results, she has a reduced bladder capacity. It is reduced by half as compared to normal persons. But the good thing is that there is some regeneration capacity of the, the bladder that we hope with time her bladder capacity will increase to some extent. Now, Tanish and then the Zeev said, Koyi, the Koyalish Tanish, Kanyaga, and then the Nagaruch, Mitsarach or Nagaruch, and Nagrishalan, Sister Azip Tasai Shalich. Is she? Bakanati, Lama Ubati. But I am ያለስ <laughs> ታዚሁላን <laughs> ወጋሁደ <laughs> Gazadi Chirenia go digam, go chirenia go, and I mean, I may but the Latin and Managon and Rage, or Jeta choose good or choose mal, the choose Chirenia Gari Girachos, not the Jemenet, Vade by the Cachirenia Coroner, that the big Danaki. Tonatuna Mavae Gamadiaga caught this gallet. Katibad, a cariango, then the Takariango, for the Takariango, Jirat, the Tijirat, in number bad.
Almaz, she was found to have a double fistula. Double fistula means a hole in communicating between the rectum and vagina and bladder and vagina. You don't have to be a woman to understand women's problem. If somebody is incontinent and uh, cannot control uh, her feces and urine, this is simple to predict what is going to happen to her in the community and in the, in the family. So uh, to relieve such a problem is a very, very, I mean, good, good job. I'm repairing the bladder and now I'm doing the rectal fistula. We are able to close the fistula in about 93% of cases. We're able to operate on 30 women a week, and so we hope this year that we'll be able to do 1,500 operations. But we estimate that there are over 100,000 waiting in the countryside in Ethiopia alone. My husband and I came to Ethiopia in 1959. The previous gynecologist that we replaced said to my husband, the fistula patients will break your heart. And that's really what they did. We didn't plan to stay, but as we began to cure them, of course, more and more came to us, so we stayed on, and I've been here ever since. My husband would still be here if he was alive. ተላንተናመን <laughs> Hulum sosial macam ni rada ada lah, ha? Tapi si kadang dia gelo, mana mula tala gengnya pasal tu. Mana keras, ha? Aku kan dia kerja mana tu sih ni ni al dia orang pulau ini berat. Nak berat mana mula tala gengnya? Fanya sih tanya show na, aku ni mungkin zai fella kan? Tapi sebab aku kerja mana, aku mesti show kau ganano. Asal tak betah macam show kau, ha? Selalu zai zai sih tu. Kapas? <laughs> Saya bertemu Malcolm. Malcolm dia lakukan. Si, dah uti Nora. Si ni kunci. Rusia itu a hidden epidemic, it's silent epidemic. Nobody talks about it. 
because it's a problem of poor women, it's a problem of women. It's 100% preventable. Lack of good obstetric service. This is the main cause of fistula. For a population of 77 million people now in Ethiopia, we've only got 146 gynecologists and obstetricians, and most of these are in the cities. So the country women are just completely neglected. This is a tragedy. If there is no any leakage on the bed, that means they are dry. But up to now, she is dry, and we hope that she will be okay. <laughs> ገና <laughs> Okay, I mean, she's on the eighth post operative day, and till now she's okay. So she will be here, I mean, for, a, for another week. So after that, we will check whether the bladder is healed or not, and the rectum is healed or not. 
If it is okay, she will go home. She will take care of them. Them is at all. Them, but them both are better. All that you see, all that you may not touch. Oh, so I'm going to do all that you need. All that you see. Yes. 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 And that's never enough. I don't need to know. If you want to stay with me, I'm not going to let you go. 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 I'm جاتوا ماسك بيوانش، أسك بتش، ماسك بيوانش، ودوست كعب بابه هنا، هين تاو جوانش. إيه كان ميزة؟ كزانة هي لاستيك وتش، وستي هنا. من دنا مساج عندنا سيتوش ناي بدنا مساج توا، عندنا سيتوش ناي سهلا. أنتي ناي من دنا مكر، بقالي نيانش شوي. إيش؟ إيش؟ أوكي. Um, usually it's very difficult for these girls to learn how to put these plugs into their urethra. It's a very small spot to try and aim for, but she was um, got it first go. First time I've ever seen anyone get it the first go, so I'm sure she'll be able to manage it very well. She's happy. I mean, I can't explain it. I have no words. I mean, I'm, I'm happy, very, very much happy. I mean, to make a lady, I mean, who has been incontinent for both urine and feces, to make her continent. I mean, that is a. I mean, her happiness is a prize that I'm getting now. Okay. <laughs> As soon as they're cured, we talk to them about their future. We tell each patient you must get to a hospital for the next baby. We give every patient a card with a description of the operation, with all the findings. So we say, when you feel the baby walking inside your stomach, you start walking towards a hospital. I'm 
ನಾನೇನು ತರಗು ಹುಷಾತ್ತಿನ ಏನು ತರಗು ನಮ್ಮ ಅಕ್ಕೋರು ಸರ್ ಈಗ ಜೀರೋ ನೋಡ್ಕ ሰውሚያ <laughs> The children are uh, orphans because their parents died of uh, HIV. We've given for bed uh, four children to take responsibility for and we've told the children this is going to be your mom and already in the, in the little ones you can see that they love her so the bonding is starting. Yes. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> I think just to have some future to look forward to has made her grown up. And now she has work to do and she's learning and it makes people grow. Giving them a responsibility, it helps them enormously.
Nova is a production of WGBH Boston. I am PBS.